Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to our new career mode, man. This is AC Milan Rebuild, man. It's a new career mode, new everything, man. It's a rebuild. I'm planning to do like an overhaul of changes in this team, man. The team is struggling. I know that. Everybody knows that. They've been struggling ever since. I think the best Milan team that we had is the one that won the 2007 Champions League. That was the super best. Yes, we have some better teams after that with the likes of Alexander Pato and whoever was coming in there. But it never really, really reached the point where you can say they are back. They are the giants of the Italian football, man. They are still called the giants of Italian football. But to me, they are more like the sleeping giant now. And they, they seem like they are going down, 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 down. Because look at last season. They did struggle, man. They struggled a bit. And this season as well, they are struggling. When you check the league table, they are down at the bottom. They are struggling. Nothing is going well. I'm planning to rebuild this team. Make them the greatest team. I'm not planning to do a one season like I did with Wolves. I'm planning to do more than one season. Two or three. What does that mean? I'm not signing older players. I'm getting rid of the older players. I'm getting young players in the team. We're gonna have some fun with this career mode. Yes, first season we're gonna struggle. I'm expecting that. But it's fine with me. I'm fine with it. So now, let's look at our top transfer targets. I have top transfer targets. Yes, I can get other players, but I have my top transfer targets that I really need. The first one we're gonna look at Abraham Konate, 79 overrated, 88 potential, 84 sprint speed as a center back that's massive. Age, he's 20, 6.4 foot tall. Man, this is gonna be a massive center back for me. If I can get him, the age is on our side. He's young, he is fast, his potential is great with the with the dynamic potential that's massive that's massive he's 6.4 which means he's tall too he should be strong on the ball we're gonna train him hard moving on from that we're moving on to our next transfer target which is then excel zagadu 79 over overall rating 86 potential 86 standing tackle that's what i love about him he's strong too that's another thing that it's not there he is very strong 6.5 foot tall age 20 still young massive good future it's the talent we keeping him you can just buy him and put him straight to the starting lineup if probably let's say we sell our best center backs that we have because some of them i know i can't play with them but moving on from that we're going to another center back who can play right back and lb his name Tilo Kera, 79 overall rating, 87 potential, 85 aggression, age 21, 6.1 foot tall. Look at the positions he can play. That's what I love about him. He can play everywhere in defense, man. You can play him everywhere in defense. He's a massive talent. Currently playing for PSG. We can get him from PSG. That's not a problem at all. According to me, this is one of the best players I can get. Those are the three center backs that I'm targeting. Finish and car. We're moving on to the middle field. My first target in the middle field is Vinicius Jr. I never had the chance to play with the guy. The guy is massive. The guy is, is the machine. 79 overall rating with 92 potential. 94 sprint speed. Age is 18 years old. He's very young. 5.9 foot tall. It's not important how tall he is. He's fast. He's a winger. His potential is massive. Overall rating currently, it's massive. You can get him into 80 before the season even start. So, that's why I'm so happy. Probably the player that they hope he was going to replace Ronaldo. Moving on to the, our next target, man. It's another massive talent. Young. It's Leon Bailey. 82 overall rating. 88 potential. 90 sprint speed age 21 5.10 tall it doesn't matter how tall it is we don't care even if he was the shortest player in in the field but look at what he can do for us he can run his potential is massive he's another like one of my main targets i think i can even play him on the right because i think he's, he's a 4-4 weak foot 
his four four star weak foot four star skill move brilliant another massive talent to our list it's just in private 75 overall rating not as highly rated as the first two 86 potential that's massive 87 sprint speed that's massive age 20 he's young brilliant 5.7 foot tall i love that four star skiller four star weak foot brilliant he can play everywhere he can play on the right he can play on the left i love that that's why i love players who are able to play with both feet on the wings because i can swipe them around that's massive that's brilliant man i would love to have him in my team as well moving on to our next target he needs no introduction man adama Traore, 74 overall rating 82 potential 96 sprint speed age 23 5.10 foot tall probably the lowest rated player on my list so far or overall i don't know but i think so far is the lowest rated player on my list man look at what he can do though his sprint speed 96 look at that he's massive he's brilliant for me i can buy him i was using him on my previous career mode you can go and watch that world's career mode yes we finished it last time we're moving on to our next target it's emmanuel dennis emmanuel dennis a guy who scored against real madrid and did the cristiano ronaldo celebration in front of madrid's fans it was more like an insult to me 76 rated plus one which means it's 77 already in fifa 20 85 potential 91 sprint speed age 21 5.9 foot tall he can play right wing left wing striker we can play him everywhere he's he's a good target as well i, I think i can get him because i'm planning to change all my wingers in this team moving on from there to going to the targets my strikers now that is the main position timo vena is my first target man i love the dude overall rated is 60 overall rating is 83 87 potential 92 sprint speed age 23 still very young there's a massive future ahead of this boy if he can keep on working hard in my list i don't have a player who's over 25 yet and i don't think i'm planning to buy any over 25 player as i said it's a rebuild it's not gonna be one season i'm planning to do two seasons man maybe or three depending on how exciting this thing will get man because i'm planning to make it so exciting hopefully it will get exciting and everything man but this guy if i can sign him i will be very happy very very happy my next target man i'm looking at this guy joseph alexander martinez 82 overall rating 85 potential 90 sprint speed look at that he's massive he is massive man i'm telling you he's a good finisher too that's what i love about him i think his finishing is like 84 85 just like timo vena who's 84 i think he's 85 that, that's why I like the dude. He's 5.7 foot tall. He have a power header threat. With that height, he have a power header threat, which means he can jump very well. I, I, I would be happy to have him. The only problem with him would he be happy to be a bench player? Because if I get Timo Werner, Timo Werner is even cheaper than him. Which means Timo Vena might be my first option, then move on to him. Would he be happy to be a bench player? I don't know. But that was the video, guys, to show you my targets and everything that you know what. This is what I'm planning to do. I don't know what you think, guys, but you can give me any suggestions. I will be happy to consider it. I'm willing to consider your suggestions and see if we can rebuild this giant man because i really really want to rebuild this massive team i really like the team man to be honest i love the team since i was young i love this team in italy it's the team that i support in Serie A. to be quite honest i was disappointed that they were kicked out of the european football for this season but i think it's a good chance for them to rebuild 
with the, like they don't have uh, those features like so many features of the Europa League because I think they were going to be in the Europa League if I'm not mistaken they don't have those many features so they can just rebuild instead and do well you know thank you so much guys for watching this the first episode is coming soon I love you I love you all bye